Hi there, it's Rianne here from Not Just Facts. So we are now about week three since you began your journey with us at Not Just Facts. Um, and hopefully you will have noticed some really good changes going on. However, some of you might be still early days and right at the beginning of your journey because it may be that you've had your problem a long time and need little baby steps. Um, however, a lot of you will feel some good benefits going on. Now, um, I want to talk about exercises. Your osteopath might start to change your exercises. So if you've been quite acute and inflamed, um, we'll go from sort of range of movement exercises and add in some stability exercises. So these are starting to, it's, it's holding positions to start getting some strength within the muscles around the joint that's the problem. So uh, it's, it's not, you know, you're not quite ready for complete, you know, let's get you stronger exercises, um, but it's just a change from just the range of movement and stretching exercises that you've experienced. Now, I know not everybody's into exercises and a lot of people come along and we give them exercises and they don't like them and don't do them. Um, but obviously if you want to keep your problem away, so stop it from returning, we need strength. And particularly for those people who don't like exercise, because <laughs> obviously you're a bit weaker than probably somebody who does some uh, a Pilates class or goes to the gym or goes running, etc. cetera. Um, so we do need to have some basic strength in your body so that it stops you hurting your back or, or shoulder or knee again. It's really important, especially for limb problems. We'll, we will give you quite a few exercises to do, but they are manageable and hopefully won't take your day up too much. As we get older, um, so our senior patients, you will need to, to really work on um, keeping yourself youthful. Um, because not so much youthful, but just being able to have good strong muscle tone because as we get older, everything starts to decline. Um, we get, our muscles get much weaker. We get something called sarcopenia. Um, you've heard of osteopenia and osteoporosis. Well, it's the same thing for muscles. So we just get less dense muscles. Um, uh, our tendons start to degenerate and so it makes things much slower to heal and or more prone to damaging, hence why you've come to see us. So it's really important that we, that we start getting our bodies exercising and it doesn't matter, you don't have to go and sweat loads in the gym. Um, but you may be doing a Pilates class once a week, which is okay, it's, it's, it's good to do, brilliant, but once a week may not be enough. So what we've got at Not Just Backs um, is a daily exercise routine, which takes 10 minutes. Now you'll need to ask your osteopath whether you're ready for this. Um, and it's on Facebook, it's free, and it's a closed Facebook group. So uh, you're sorry you have to join Facebook if you want to partake. Um, however, it's with me and I put in a programme of three exercises generally each week and you do them every day. And it takes about 10 minutes, between 10 and 12 minutes or a bit, a bit shorter, some, some weeks. And what it includes is a squat, um, some strengthening to our, our legs, our glutes and our core. Um, some weeks we do balance work because again balance is really important especially as we get older so this this Facebook group is really designed for generally people of 40 plus but we do have younger people on there we do have some postnatal mums on there um, of course if you're a postnatal mum then people just let me know because we just alter certain things for you each week because there's certain things you can't do um, but generally it's for the 40 pluses. So, and it's people that don't really exercise um, and there are varying weights. So I increase um, the weights as we go along, 
because uh, obviously some people have been doing it with me for a couple of years. And so obviously I'm much stronger than those people who have started with me. Um, and we've got people with various problems, shoulders, knees, disc problems that they've recovered from and all sorts of things. But it's there on the whole, it should be a little bit of fun and something to do and hopefully keep you inspired to do them every day. Um, just to help really with your recovery. So I'm just gonna share the screen and I'll show you the, uh, the group. Here we go. So this is, um, I can't quite see the top, but it's called Not Just Backs Daily Exercises. And if I scroll up, what I do is I post a video once a week and I then write what the exercises are as well. But it's also worth watching the video because we want to have good form when we're exercising. And then people then, they can, to keep you, you know, inspired and committed, generally people write done when they've done, um, so, that, so that they just get on with it. So you find a right time of day to do your exercises so that you can do them daily. And this will just really help prevent problems happening again. So it's just one thing that we offer at Not Just Backs. It's not for everybody, um, but just ask your osteopath whether the, you're, you're appropriate now at the right stage to start doing a few little exercises. And you may only choose one of the exercises a week just to do daily. It might be a squat to start off with. Um, and then you might check with your osteopath that you're doing them right, the squats, if you feel something's not right but pe people um, can message me as well uh, within the group and just ask um, any questions that they might have so it's just one thing I'm just going to stop that one thing that might help you on your journey of recovery so I hope uh, you've enjoyed my few little videos and uh, don't forget that if you like receiving health videos and you need to sign up or just ask the receptionist to sign you up for our health videos and there are lots of things how to deal with discs and neck pain and pins and needles in the arms and when to use ice and heat and all those sort of topics that that people want to know about um, and yeah we have a little chat and a discussion about it and I show you some pictures of anatomy because I love anatomy um, which you know it's fascinating and if, <laughs> You might find it interesting too, I hope. So anyway, but it's really been nice to talk to you and I will uh, see you perhaps in the practice. Take care. Bye-bye.